So this is the block, the lino block, at the end of the third colour, ready for cutting the final one. So this final darkest colour is going to be just on the figure. And I normally, for this, I would be looking at clearing away everything other than the figure, but I'm going to use a small roller to ink just the figure. So that means that I can ignore everything else on the block and just concentrate on the cutting on the figure itself. So as per <coughs> the last occasions, I'm cutting away everything that I wanted to remain the previous printed colour which was that grey, warm grey. It's really a bit like cutting away all the contents of the skin and just leaving some bits what's almost like a key drawing left standing, so positive lines on the hands, face, um, and then it should be good to go. using black but in this case I am going to because I like the kind of flatness that it'll give that kind of bleak look to the colour. So now the tricky bit, the local inking with a small roller. So there's some bits like around the front of the puffed up chest here but it's going to be done fairly accurately. Other than that I'm not too worried about it coming outside the edge of the figure because the strong outline is still going to define the figure so as long as I'm reasonably careful but you can still feather the ink out. Last time into the press, hoping that it'll all work out and all put together. So there we are, that's it all finished. The four colour COVID 19 puffed up volunteer. I'm sure that's someone that we all recognise one way or another. I'll leave you with a wee sequence of how the print developed so you can see it stage by stage. throughout this film for the state of my cuticles. I've been so worried about the state of Scottish football. <laughs>